Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In the last video, we have seen the interfacing of a simple single LED with an Arduino microcontroller. In this video, we will see the common anode and common cathode configuration for LED interfacing. So let's begin by creating a new project. The components required are Arduino microcontroller, LEDs, and resistors. Let us use LEDs in red color for representing the common cathode configuration while LEDs in blue color to represent the common anode configuration. The most obvious question at this point might be what is the common anode and common cathode configuration? As the name suggests, in the common cathode configuration the cathode terminals of all the LEDs are commonly connected to the ground terminal, while the anode terminals are connected to the digital output pins via resistors as shown here. Contrarily in common anode configuration, the anode terminal of all the LEDs are commonly connected to the external power supply or 5 volts via resistors, and the cathode terminals are connected to digital output pins as shown here. Let's jump to the coding. To turn on the LEDs in common anode configuration we need to set the digital output pins to logic 0 while to turn on the LED in common cathode configuration we need to set the digital output pins to logic 1. Here, we have set logic 1 on all digital output pins which mean only LEDs in common cathode configuration will glow. 
With Logic Zero set on all digital output pins, only LEDs in common anode configuration will glow. That's it. Let us simulate the code and understand the working of the common anode and common cathode configuration of LEDs. In the first cycle of code, with all digital output ports set to logic 1, LEDs connected in common cathode configuration only glow. This is because the circuit gets completed with current flowing from the digital output port via LED to the ground. In the second cycle of code, with all digital output ports set to logic 0, LEDs connected in common anode configuration only glow. This is because the circuit gets completed with current flowing from 5 volts pin via LED to the ground. You can follow the current directions in the common anode and common cathode configurations to understand the flow of current as shown here. Hope you like this video. Kindly subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates if not already subscribe. Thank you. See you soon.